Here's the latest news from Fantastic Fireworks. Slaying dragons at Warwick Castle. Echoes of Churchill at Blenheim Palace. Beating the fire risk at Henley Regatta. A sky full of stars at the Bedford Proms. And Liverpool says welcome home with daylight fireworks. Hello and welcome. I'm Susan McKean and here's what's making the news this month at Fantastic Fireworks. It's been an amazing summer and we've been in all the hotspots. Hottest of them all is Warwick Castle where they have just launched a fiery new show called Dragon Slayer. Featuring stunning 3D projections, flames and fantastic fireworks. It's an epic story about one man's battle with a fire-breathing monster. It is right. Liam Bartlett, head of events, told us the fireworks looked amazing, the audience loved it. Dragon Slayer is running every weekend until the end of August. You can book tickets at the address shown below. Never has so much been owed by so many to so few. The famous wartime words of Sir Winston Churchill echoed out across the grounds of his birthplace at Blenheim Palace last month. The Great British Garden Party celebrated the great man's life in 3D projections, speech, and there was even a spitfire revving its engine to the delight of the audience. Our big firework finale rounded it all off in style. Heather Carter, Blenheim's operation manager, told us, a fab display as always. It's been a great year for open air concerts and the hot weather has brought audiences out in their thousands. We were at the Bedford Proms last weekend, lighting up the sky at the London Gala Orchestra hit full throttle on classics like Ride of the Valkyries and O Fortuna. It all ended with a frenetic rendition of the Can Can and we turned the sky into a knees up of glittering gold. Mark Harrison of LPH Concerts told us, what a fantastic night, I couldn't have asked for a better finale. Fire has been a big risk this summer, but we have been able to stage all our displays safely. For the show marking the end of the world-famous Henley Regatta, the launch site was surrounded by tinder-dry crops and woodland. But thanks to the support of organisers, our firing team left nothing to chance. We even hired in a privately manned fire engine, just in case. Another brilliant show, said Councillor Will Hamilton. I was most impressed with the expertise and professionalism you showed in dealing with the fire risks. And finally, the year's biggest yacht race gave us the chance to show off our new daylight fireworks last month. As huge clipper sailing boats arrived back in Liverpool after a year-long round-the-world voyage, we were there with a razzmatazzical welcome. Colourful smoke trails, fireworks, confetti and CO2 jets peppered the air as spectators applauded the crews. Culture Liverpool's event organiser Julie Lowe was ecstatic. You nailed our brief from start to finish with some amazing surprises. What a spectacular performance. You did the city of Liverpool proud. Well, that's it from me. For more information about any of our services, please visit our website, speak to our team or email us. I'll be back again soon with more news from Fantastic Fireworks, double winners of the British Fireworks Championship, where we make you look amazing. Thank you for watching.